about making sure that here in America, folks who work hard can live their lives with dignity and respect. President Biden in Philadelphia speaking about the American worker, the economy, and how his administration and unions are making America stronger. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Jim Donovan. Welcome to CBS 3 Eyewitness News at noon, now streaming live on CBS News Philly. And I'm Janelle Burrell, the president speaking moments ago at the National AFL-CIO Convention. You watch his speech live on CBS News Philly. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo was inside of the Pennsylvania Convention Center for the president's address. Matt is now joining us live with the details. Hi there, Matt. Hey, the president wrapped up his speech here at the AFL-CIO convention about 20 minutes ago. Before he took to the stage behind me, he was introduced as the most pro-union president ever. <laughs> Biden addressed the economy, saying his administration is working to make Buy American a reality, not just a slogan. The president also admitted gas prices are high, but he says he's working to, quote, block Putin's gas hike, although he didn't say how. Biden spoke for more than a half hour here at the 29th F uh, AFL-CIO Constitutional Convention. It brings together 57 unions from around the country, representing 12 and a half million workers. You know, if investment bankers in America, they're not all bad guys, they're not bad, but I guess what, if they went on strike, not a whole hell of a lot would happen. But guess what? Guess what? I tell this to my buddy, if the IBW went on strike, everything shuts down. All of you, go down the road. I'm serious. No, you guys don't understand. You don't talk, you don't, I don't think you appreciate how critically important you are. I'm not trying to be nice to you, it's just a fact. Folks, we need an economy built from the middle out and the bottom up, not the top down. Because I know when the middle class does well, everybody is. The wealthy do very well. They're never hurt. And right now we're working to get reaction to Biden's speech, and we'll bring you that starting on Eyewitness News at 4. For now, reporting live in Center City, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Matt, we'll see you later this afternoon. And here's a live look at Air Force One waiting to take the president back to Washington, D.C. So if you're in the area of the airport, do expect some road closures. President Biden in Philadelphia for the AFL-CIO convention will have more from his visit on Eyewitness News starting at 4. And you can always get your news online at cbsphilly.com or streaming on CBS News Philly.